Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, this is the world of Wayne. We now have part 51 of Hashit Partworks Build the Terminator. Okay, so we're going to be working on some more pelvis parts now. Though we haven't got many parts in this issue, uh, but they are going to be attached to the main Terminator. So we're going to need to bring that up. Let's just show you what we've got. Just got these three parts here. And basically, they're going to be fitting into the areas to actually just hide the holes that we had in the pelvic section. Uh, we're going to need some glue for this one because we're going to be covering the screw holes as well where we screwed this in. And then finally, when it's finished, we're just going to have this section looking like that and a spare section which will go on in a later stage. Now, in the next issue, we're going to be assembling a muscle and fit another pelvic plate. So uh, again, not too much to do in the next issue. I'm sure this is going to be a really quick one. And normally now, I'd say let's get cracking. Not today though. Uh, <laughs> I've been to the shops today and I think I've already announced this on social media. But tomorrow, I can't believe this has actually gone live. I'm so happy we have got... Bring the Spitfire to life, build a model Spitfire Mark 1A, which is going to be good. Now, this is available from your shops now, and you can order this online. And I've put a link down the bottom where you can go for that. This video will be live tomorrow, and we'll go into the in-depths of this. Trust me, check out my website, because the free gifts this comes with is excellent, especially the last free gift, if you're a premium subscriber, of what you get on the last delivery, which brought a real big smile to my face. But check that out on the website there. Uh, but without further ado now, let's get cracking. There we go, I've brought our old friend Mr. Terminator up and the uh, first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting the pelvic plate in. Now the pelvic plate is going to fit into this gap area here and uh, I don't know if you can see this but we have got some lugs just on the bottom there. We've got two lug holes probably on the side camera just in here for this to press into. So this is going to be going in to here just like this. And then once that's in, looks just like that. Still able to move around without that flying out but that looks pretty good. Now I'm going to turn it round because on this side here, try and line this up, we've got this part here where we had a screw and we need to put a cap on this. Uh, so for that reason we've got the cap here and that again looks just like this and as you see it's got some notch holes in there. They're going to go just over the top of those holes there so it is pretty easy to line this up just like that and that's how that's going to fit in. But this is glued in. So what we're going to do is we're going to put some glue in this, but we're going to put some glue just onto this section here and down the other side here. I'm using my cocktail sticks for this because uh, this is going to be coming, this is going to be actually uh, attached forever. So <laughs> it doesn't matter how much glue I put in it. But once you've got it in, let's get this lined up. Just like that, it will fit nice and flat, just holding it in place. And there we go. That's all we've got to do for that part there. We are doing a lot of work just actually doing the cosmetics around the pelvic area here. But that's on nice and tight. And then we've just got this last area here, which is a muscle connector, looking just like that. I'll show you on both cameras. Uh, which doesn't do anything in this issue. <laughs> We're not using it. So basically all we had to do in that issue was fit two parts. So, nice quick video. I said it would be, didn't I? But uh, that's it for this issue. As I said, stay tuned tomorrow for the uh, first edition of the Mark 1 Spitfire. This obviously was in trial a few months ago, and I did do a video for that already. Pretty similar what we've got to do in this one, but uh, now it's a full run. <laughs> I've got a big smile on my face, I'll tell you that now. But anyway, listen, if you like that video, please remember to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed already, please remember to subscribe. Other than that, take care.